Linux versus Windows. The reason I'm including this lesson in this training is because when you need to know a lot about a certain technology, it is good to compare one thing with another. Like whenever you can need to compare, um, let's say, a car, you have to have a certain comparison with other cars. For example, if you are buying a Mercedes, you should know a few differences between Mercedes and BMW and Audi. So this way you can make a right decision or you would know the features that you will be getting with your new car. So that's why I'm comparing Linux with Windows. So you will know exactly what the difference is, the basic difference, and you will be able to answer any questions that come up during the interview. The first difference between Linux and Windows is about the price. Of course, Linux is free, and not all the distributions are free. Red Hat is not free. You would have to pay for subscription and support, whereas Windows is not free. You would have to pay for it. Ease, Linux is not user-friendly. You would have to run user commands to get your tasks done, whereas Windows, you have a GUI to do most of those tasks. All you have to do is double click, run the program, and you're done. Most of the things are done through the GUI. Reliability, Linux is very reliable. Oftentimes, you, it runs for months and years where you don't even have to reboot it. Where in Windows, it often requires a reboot. Now, Windows have done um, a lot better. Its operating system has become a lot better and stable where you don't need to reboot or it doesn't crash oftentimes. Software, most of the softwares are enterprise level software that runs in Linux, whereas Windows, there's a much larger selection of software, for example, office, games, utilities, and a lot more. Also, Windows softwares are like chat, chat, and social media softwares. Multitasking. Now, multitasking is one of the uh, basic reasons why people came up with Unix and Linux type of operating system because back then they needed some type of operating system that could perform multitasking. And for those who don't do not know what multitasking is in terms of operating system, it's about running uh, multiple processes at the same time. Whereas in Windows, um, you could run multiple multitasking, but you do need a lot of high CPU and memory. Now, please do remember, I'm not trying to say Windows is bad or, or Linux is the best. Well, I'm trying to compare some of the basic features. Windows have done an amazing job in the past few years where they have come up with the tools like Active Directory, Domain Controller, Microsoft Exchange, and um, you SQL Server running on Windows. They have done an amazing job and they have pioneered the market in that. So there are a few things that are very good in Windows and in Linux, uh, there aren't in terms of programming. Security-wise, um, Linux is very secure and Windows is somewhat secure. And why is that? It's because Windows is more vulnerable to, uh, to um, hacking because it is uh, facing the internet. Because people run uh, like social media type of things or um, chatting sessions and a lot of different things that they run and they're they are accessing the internet. Where in Linux, you don't access the internet. Um, open source Linux is open to public. There's the code is out there. You can modify the code. You can come up with your own operating system. Where it's Windows, you cannot do anything. It is owned by Microsoft. You cannot have the code open or revealed to anyone.